Hey, what's up everyone? Chris here from Brick Players Union, and in this video, I'm gonna share with you my Lego Mach Nissan Titan. So, let's check it out. The Nissan Titan is a full-size pickup truck manufactured in the US for the North American market by Japanese car company Nissan, and is named for the Titans of Greek mythology. It's available in both two-door single cab and four-door crew cab versions, and is currently in its second generation, with the first generation being produced from 2003 to 2015, and the second generation being produced from 2016 to the present. Now, this is a special mock to me because it's based on the real-life Nissan Titan of fellow YouTuber Josh from Mini Brickworld. Now, he's a subscriber of mine, and after seeing some of my other mock vehicle videos, he contacted me and gave me a commission to build a Lego version of his Titan for his Sig Fig Rocky Brick. So I asked him to send me some photos of his Titan, and I got to work. Now, Josh has a four-door crew cab Titan in silver, which is a color that Lego doesn't make very many parts in. So normally, I would build it in medium gray. But I built this mock a while ago, and at the time, Lego didn't make the city half fenders in medium gray, so he decided to go with dark gray instead. And I really like how the dark gray one turned out, so I decided to build one of my own in dark gray too. As for the specs of the mock, it has a main body that is six studs wide, with the extra large off-road tires adding another one and a half studs to each side, bringing the overall width to nine studs. It has an overall length of 22 studs bumper to bumper, and it has a height of eight and two thirds bricks to the top of the roof. As for the build itself, starting up front, I built the main assembly studs on side, and then I used some smaller one by one studs on side brackets in medium gray to create the vertical slats of the grill. It has a two tone front bumper, so I built the center section in medium gray, and I also gave it a medium gray skid plate underneath, mounted studs upside down. I used a four by six by two thirds wedge panel for the hood, to which I mounted some black windshield wipers. And under the hood, like I do with most of my mocks, I gave it a two by two molded motor, a battery with positive and negative terminals, a transparent green coolant reservoir, and a transparent blue washer fluid reservoir. Now moving on to the side, the first thing you'll probably notice is the extra large 37 by 18 off-road tires which give the Titan a really aggressive look. And to make room for those tires, I lifted the Titan up an extra two bricks in height and mounted them on these large Technic snaps with the extra beefy suspension. I also gave the Titan a set of side step rails, some matching door handles, and a set of side view mirrors all in black. Now, when it came time to build the bed, I really wanted to create the small gap between the bed and the cab to give it an extra touch of realism. So I used some studs on side brackets and a little bit of Lego math to build the bed wall sideways, leaving a gap that is one half plate wide, which I think looks just right. I used one by four and one by six black tiles for the bed rails, and I used a bunch of these one by two grill tiles for the bed liner. Round back, I brick built the taillights with one by one plates in transparent red for the brake lights and transparent clear for the reverse lights. I built the tailgate handle with a one by two plate with the slide. I gave it a black step bumper. And if you look underneath, I gave it a black exhaust pipe mounted on an angle just behind the rear wheel. Now, taking a look at the interior, I did something a little different with the front seats. I built them two-tone using some 1x2 Palisade bricks in dark gray for the seat backs and cushions, and I used 1x2 hinge plates in black so they would be fully adjustable. The rear seat is a simple bench seat that I built using some 2x2 two two tiles in black. Up front, I gave it a 2x2 two two steering wheel and an instrument cluster on the driver's side, and I gave it a large touchscreen interface on the passenger side. And finally, I also made an off-road package for the Titan, consisting of a front brush guard with fog lights, 
a roof rack, and a bed mounted roll bar with some rally lights. All right, there you have it, my Lego Mach Nissan Titan. I really hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, you can let me know by giving me a thumbs up. If you have not yet subscribed to the channel, please do. That is, of course, always greatly appreciated. And if you have a minute before you go, please leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. I'd also like to give a shout out to Austin Luke, Anna Leonardo, Collins Darkwa, and an extra special shout out to Josh at Mini Brick World, who is a great guy and also has a really great Lego city. So after you watch a bunch more of my videos, be sure to go over and check Josh out at Mini Brick World. And finally, if you'd like me to give you a shout out, let me know down in the comments and I'll be sure to do so in an upcoming video. And on that note, I'd like to thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next video.